Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back. You are watching for tech. Recently, OnePlus released their Oxonus V850 update for their flagship series devices like OnePlus 12, 13. We already did the in-depth review of those updates on OnePlus 12R and 13R. You can check review video links of those devices in description. Last but not least, OnePlus 11 series devices also received this update at the end of August 2025. It was gradually rolling out for global devices and finally I got it via beta update section. It's an incremental update of 921 MB or Oxonus 15 V841 update and V840 update for OnePlus 11. It have huge change log so today in this video we are going to review each and every small change of this update for OnePlus 11 series devices. Along with performance test and at the end I also discuss about the issues of green line concerns in the users regarding OnePlus 11 series. So don't skip any part of this video, watch it until the end. Now with the further delay, let's get started. So after updating to new version, Oxonus updater is now upgraded with new Oxonus 15 V850 build number. Version section build number is just mentioned as V850. There is no SOTA version number is mentioned because August V100 P01 SOTA update changes are already included in this update for flagship series devices that we are going to review soon. The major change of the device details is a new August 2021 security patches. Old V840 update was on July security patches. Now we will review all the new changes of this update one by one. We will start with minor feature and at the end we will show you the major changes of this update. OnePlus team did a small improvement in the multi-window screen animations. But I noticed that this new full screen expansion animation of multi-window screen is new one in this update which resembles with animations of hyperverse except that animations of multi window opening repositioning resizing are lot more improved as compared to previous versions next are some new features of private safe for oneplus photos application in private safe we can now directly able to share images or videos next for private safe albums we can change the core photos of albums like that if i want to apply this image as a cover photo just tap on this three dot menu select customize cover photo and then select any image that you want to apply as a cover photo and then tap on set as cover this is the way you can change cover images of any albums next you can sort and view images of private save by time just select option from this menu as a time modified and all images will be sorted out with date and time of photos taken next now you can move images of private save albums to any newly created other folder just select photos tap on move and create new album and images will be immediately gets moved into the new other folder in the recent panel by dragging down the app recent card who can lock the applications in the RAM memory. If you do this, you will get this lock icon on the recent app card. If you want to unlock them from the memory, repeat the same step one more time. This will unlock the applications from the RAM memory. For split screen mode, applications are now no longer restricted to fixed aspect ratios, means who can adjust the ratios as you need it. We can expand or minimize the applications to any screen size as we want. Next, simplified banner notifications now got new gestures to control notifications. When we are watching videos or playing games, simplified banner notification will pop up like this. Now we can open this notification by just dragging downward or by just single tap on the banner notification. Last and major feature of this update is new back on link messaging feature. Previously, back on link feature was only introduced to make calls, but now if you have any OnePlus devices running with new Oxonus V850 update, you will get message option in back on link. So we can send messages, can send stickers, or can able to send any images to any other back on link supported devices. These are all the new features of this new update. 
If you ask me about the performance of this update, I can say it's very good. Because I didn't feel any kind of lag whatsoever after updating like I face on the OnePlus 12R, everything is buttery smooth. I did the Geekbench test to confirm numerical improvement of the device after update and here we got a 29 and 3188 for single and multi-core respectively without performance mode. And while with performance mode, the score significantly improved and I got the results of 1720 and 4085 respectively. It's a huge uplift in the Geekbench scores with performance mode. For GPU Graphics API on OpenGL's graphics, we got the score of 5935 and 6161 without and with performance mode respectively. And for Vulkan Graphics API scores were 7035 and 7343 without and with performance mode respectively. Here again performance mode scores are a lot better than scores without performance mode. But I didn't notice a significant improvement for Antutu benchmark scores. Without performance mode score was 13,21,161 and with performance mode score was 13,28,433. Only 7,200 points improvement is noticed after running tests with performance mode. Still, we can confirm that the new update brings slight improvement in the performance of OnePlus 11R and everything is running buttery smooth. I will release the battery performance of this update after 2-3 to three days of intensive testing via our Telegram channel and YouTube community post. Last and the most important question most of OnePlus 11R users always ask me, will we face any kind of green line issues after update? The answer is no. After every update with frequent intervals, I did screen test using device info application and with none of updates from last one year, I didn't got any green line or green tint issue. If you are not a heavy user like playing heavy games for longer duration, then this will not happen at all. Green line issue actually happening due to the heavy temperature of devices due to the heavy task. So I suggest you to take frequent breaks while doing any kind of heavy task like gaming. This is all about for OnePlus 11 series Oxygen S15 V850 update. Don't forget to like and share this video, subscribe to our channel, press the bell icon to get notifications of our upcoming battery performance results of this update. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Take care. Bye bye.